McQuay, life is getting quite exciting. Don't explain it to me. You're in a situation, anything. You just found 20p. Life is getting quite exciting. You just, you just bought a new car. Life is getting quite exciting. It's for anyone. We can go deep with it, like, cool, planning for my dreams. I'm planning my success. Life is getting quite exciting. It, it, it works for everything, man. It works for everything, man. Like, the quail. For the past two years, I've been sleeping on the floor because it's good for my back. I have cold showers in the morning to strengthen my willpower. It's good for my skin and it's the first challenge of the day. I splash my face seven times in the morning and then apply my lotion. I try and eat four oranges a day and I fast 24 hours on Tuesdays because it helps me focus. I try and drink four pints of water a day to stay hydrated. Who are you waiting for? A dog is soaking. And he looks so sad, look how sad he looks. That's fucked, man. Basically, for people thinking, if it's a joke, is it serious? 100% it's serious. I wouldn't even say it's a joke, only because I'm not trying to make it funny. Only reason it would come out funny is because my ideas. That's just the way I write. And I'm not surprised why people find it a joke. Like, I mean, get, getting busy, you might think it's a joke, but it was literally a song for my future. I take the music seriously, I just don't take myself seriously. As you can see, man cashed out 10 grand on Burberry. And now, and now you'll switch to the next tape of then me, my mum saying, yeah, so we were very lucky to get the council house here. Everyone thinks he's rich, but he actually isn't. And that's just pretty much it. A relationship with my mum is probably like the most grateful thing I'm happy about and grateful about, like, when I do finish a, an instrumental or a song, I will always show it to my mum. You know, it's like if she, if my mum says, I really like this, then I know that it is definitely good. It's not just me, like, thinking, you know, me being gassed, do you know what I mean? But if someone's like, mm, I don't think he's very good, as you can tell, his flow's not that good, like, I like that, man. If someone said that to me, he's like, thank you, man, like, I'm, I'm gonna watch out for that next time. On them cars, I roll on tubes. Catch me getting gassed on them ES, they're my grooves. Yeah. My lips look dry, man. It's because I'm half black. Where'd you get your outfit from? Mermaid.com. Is it? Do <laughs> <laughs> they're bigger than you, G. <laughs> the first show in East London when I did not realise that that many people were going to come and it wasn't, it wasn't planned. I think that moment was so strong that now all, the, you know, all these other things, it's like, cool, that's the plan. Like, I'm not, I'm not being overwhelmed by it anymore. And that's because it's like, this is the plan, this is what I'm going for, that's it, do you know what I mean? Do you know oh. what? Lacoste always say, life is a beautiful sport. Oi. And where are we, G? We're in London, man. We're in the river, G. I've got fans, my lovely fans, actually just there that want to see me perform and do my music. It's so peaceful. It's a feeling that not that many people will experience, which is, which is a shame. 
because it's such an amazing feeling, you know? As soon as you jump on stage, I'm just full of confidence, you know? And like, as soon as I then leave, and the show's over, I'm just so sad and I'm, I'm so upset like that I've now got to wait to do this again. It just feels like such a come down. If I'm having a bit of a weird day, if my friend then calls me and I'm just talking to him on the phone or I go out and I'm chilling, like that's just all my worries gone, you know? So it's extremely important. I like it's all black, like all black guns. I see a friend, yeah, where you can call them any day and be like, oh, what are you saying? You can have a flowing conversation on the phone. You can have just a conversation with no anxiety. That's a friend. If there's something weird between, like, the two of us, like, you know, straight away, it's like there's just no chemistry here. Oh, sorry, sorry. Are you fasting? I'm fasting right now. Wait, did you drop anything for Len as well? For what? It'd be the cameraman that just, like, takes bare shit. Life's getting quite exciting, fam. Gee! <laughs> yeah, take a sip of that, man. Liquid. Try that, man. Liquid, man. <laughs> oh, you don't know. Bobby, bitch. <laughs> Bobby, bitch. <laughs> Life gets me so lean, so lean, so lean, so I'm here. Much fear, life gets me so lean, so lean, so lean, so I'm here, not having much fear. Used to sip lean, used to be mean, now I'm out here doing bits with a team. Yeah, they're brand new, rolling better than your crew. I'm just living life, baby, you should do, you should do. I'm finna, finna grow, keep growing hard. Me getting gassed on them, yes, they're my grooves. Now let me see the moves. Now, now let me see the moves on the dance floor. Getting bruised, life gets me so lean, so lean, so lean, so I'm here, not having much fear. Life gets me so lean, so lean, so lean, so I'm here, not having much fear. Hi, man. I'll get six wings. Six wings. Oh, just two pounds, please. 